Make a zoom pizza dough. That'd be like if I died in a juggling accident. No, 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 no. Got my phone and I've got my bubbly. Hi everybody. I'm here today with some cloth. We're gonna do some things, new things. Ooh, this looks, this looks fancy. It does look fancy. Oh man. These you're... especially are fancy. These are spinning stars or dapo stars is what I originally heard them being called. Um, this particular brand is called Flyper. They, the awesome company, they sent me these so I could try them out and learn them. And look, they're so pretty. Look at the pretty designs. <laughs> I picked this one out especially. Oh, that one looks all tie-dye. It looks like the moon. Mm-hmm. The galaxy. Looks like space. Which is not a planet. Wait. Oh yes, so to flash back to uh, a time before now. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Is a moon not a planet? No, it's 100% not a planet. <laughs> Is the moon a planet? Question mark. Where we had a dispute as to what a planet was. I said a fact and then you thought I was wrong. Turns out a planet and a moon are not the same thing. Nope. <laughs> No, they are not. I win. In spite of looking and acting and generally being exactly the same. They don't act the same because a planet orbits a star and the moon orbits a planet. There's a difference. We're splitting hairs at this point. Anyway, back to the point. So yeah, this is a doppel star or a spinning star. It's a really great, cool skill that I'm not good at where you spin this around like a pizza on your finger. And it looks really cool. I, I can't do it. Um, I've tried it a few times on my Instagram. Clearly, it's really hard for me. I have friends that are juggly friends that can just do it, and they just sit there and they just... Mm -hmm. And for some reason, it's just not clicking in my head. I'm hoping today is that day. And <laughs> like I said, these ones were sent to me by the fabulous Flyper, which is a great company. They have so many cool designs. If you wanna buy one and try one for yourself, you can use my promo code, Taylor underscore tries, for some monies off. Go give it a try. I'm just, Thanks. I don't even know if like, I know there are tricks, but I'm not there yet. So I'm just gonna try to learn how to spin it. And I know that the first step is to like pop it up like a pizza. Cause I was first introduced to this a little less than a year ago in Guatemala. Ooh, um. <laughs> world traveled. Yeah, and I know there's like, and then when I was in England, some other guy showed me that like there was another way to start it. But the way that I found the easiest was this like pizza popping method. And you like do this with your hand. Like a dance. Just like that. Mm -hmm. You should learn how to dance. I, sh I really want to learn how to dance. <laughs> <sighs> Is it just because it has your name in it? You should learn how to dance. <laughs> I don't know if that's entirely true. Yeah. <laughs> okay, so I'm just going to jump right into it. <laughs> it's going to be not mm -hmm. great. All right, let's start popping. <laughs> Make us some pizza dough. Yeah, knead that bread. When I feel like... I, I, I know he taught me at one point like this cool other way to do it, but I can't. And I, I remember it feeling easier. That's not it, but I can't remember how to do it. <laughs> is that? That's pretty cool. Yeah, this is the, always the trickiest part of learning anything new is that you sort of, oh. hey, that's not bad. I mean, we're exactly 30 seconds in. <laughs> I mean, I'm hoping that this just clicks at some point. And I've actually never used this company's. Oh. Um, I've always used another one that I bought in England. Uh, mm -hmm. And it's a little heavier. And so I'm hoping this is actually easier because it's like lighter. And where are these made? Ooh. Ooh. Oh, I just can't get it to spin. Oh, man, that's, that's, that's immediately fancy. I mean, the flippy <laughs> part is not the trick though. It's the spinning. Mm. Uh, these ones, uh, I think this company's from Israel, which is awesome. Nice. All the way from Israel with love. I don't know if they make them in Israel, but the company's from Israel, which I'd love to go to someday. Mm. It looks like pizza. So I'm just gonna take a second and get comfortable with that. Whoa. <laughs> that didn't take long. <laughs> to get spinning it? Yeah. Well, I mean, I have practiced this part. I just can't seem to get the, the finger part, which is this. 
It's, right. I know it's subtler than that. Like, it's right. just, you find a point and it just spins. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta find your inner Harlem Globetrotter. I've, I've never been good at spinning stuff. I'm not good at Diablo. I'm not good at, at basketball spinning. I'm gonna try the red side down, see if that helps. Dude, we should totally try basketball spinning. <laughs> <laughs> Not exhausting. I'm not out of shape. Shh. <laughs> <laughs> gotta get back on that weave uh, switch fit. Yeah, I guess. Ring fit adventure anymore. switch. Can't do it. I can do it. I'm gonna get it. I'm just the first, gonna. The first step to doing it is stopping and saying, I can't do it. <laughs> you know, it's actually like a really intense arm workout because you're just doing this. Well, this is going to solve your other problem of not being able to do pull-ups. Yeah. Maybe by the end of this, I'll know how to do pull-ups. I'm going to check the camera to make sure that it's high enough. Because this is a new skill. So one sec. Yeah. <laughs> that was magic. See how I wasn't holding it? And now I am. Mm -hmm. It's almost like... I am magic. Sure. You know I'm magic. You live here. <laughs> <laughs> like, the spinning part is impossible. I mean, like, impossible is a really loaded term. I mean, I know. I'm just... I know that... It, I know I can do it. Don't worry. I'm not going to get frustrated, like, to the point of stopping. Look, what you need to do is... What you need to do is get a better thing, yeah. and then you also... It really helps if you put weights on the ends of the stars. You're also know, just something. doing it wrong. It's like, I know I'm doing it wrong. It's not working. <laughs> if I were doing it right, it would be working, wouldn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah. Just remember the shirt you're wearing. Hakuna Matata. Yeah, Co copyright, copyright. <laughs> I can sing the song. I don't know if that's true. I don't know if that's true. I think you can do covers of songs on YouTube. But Disney, though. Yeah, good point. <laughs> I love Disney. Yeah. I didn't used to love Disney, and now I do. They love that you love Disney. Yeah. <laughs> I will give them all my money. <gasps> huh? Huh? It's, it's closer than you've ever been. That was the longest I think I've done it. It also felt a little tilted. I feel like it needs to be straight. Like a pizza. Can I also, once I get good at this, learn how to make pizza? Yeah. That'll be like the tenth video. You're starting to flex on your skills. Ooh. It's like <laughs> I keep it keeps hitting me in the face. <sighs> My arm. We've all been there. <laughs> all right, there we go. Nope, nope, nope. Lost it. It's so pretty when it spins, though. Mm -hmm. The pretty colors, like from a, from the bottom. If I just keep my finger there, it's fine. Wah, wah. Wah, wah. Wah, wah. Yeah. I start panicking. It needs to be subtle. I don't know if this is the real term for this, but when I was younger in the juggling world, we used to call it it padiddling when you would sit and spin something on your finger. Have you ever mm -hmm. heard that term? No. Yeah, it was like you could do it with pillows. And I have never done that. But I know people will sit there and just like, they'll padiddle books, they'll padiddle trays, they'll padiddle pillows. So now I'm padiddling cloth. Nope. This did not work. Hui, 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 hui. So I heard you and Jen talking about, this is ugly, but I'm spinning it, so I'm going to count it as <laughs> it's working. <laughs> I heard you and Jen talking, like, I feel like not, it was like last week about like the new Fast and the Furious trailer. Oh, so yes, well, I mean, it is, it's always an event whenever a new Fast and the Furious trailer drops. It's, I've uh, never seen any of them, except Tokyo Drift. This is... All right. I'm okay with it. <laughs> Look, audience, I'm working on it, okay? <laughs> I'm working on it. I, I just feel like I need to do like a marathon. 
Yes. I, I would mean, love to truth. figure out a way to like stream it, but you can't stream the movie. You can't and, stream the movie. <laughs> but I could like do a stream where I like. And it's I'm eight, like go. And it's like, it's. I mean, if you count the spinoff. There's oh, a man. spinoff. I mean, well, there's Luke. There's Hobbs and Shaw. Oh right, that came out like last year, right? Yes. How many movies are there? There are. So they're on the ninth Fast and the Furious movie, and there's one spinoff. So there's been ten movies. And recently there was talk that they were going to split the 10th movie into two parts and have it be the end of the franchise. You're going to Harry Potter it. Uh, yes. Nice. Nice. Yes, very much. Harry Potter, uh, Hunger Games, you, you know how they do. Twilight. Right? Yeah. Divergence Breaking Dawn part did one. it, except that they never made the second part. <laughs> I really liked The Maze Runner. I watched that like a few months ago. I don't know. They're all the same. I was, I was really <laughs> impressed with it. I thought it was like surprisingly good for a young adult. Yeah. Dystopian <laughs> show For the that... same young adult dystopian future. That's but it was, it was good. <laughs> wow. I, it's... <laughs> it's just... Ex <laughs> I get frustrated too. It's okay. It's okay to get frustrated. It's just you can't let the frustration stop you. Is this one bigger? It feels bigger. Maybe a little bit bigger, yes. Let's do a test. It is bigger. That's why it's my favorite. Mm-hmm. <laughs> I feel like maybe that makes it harder. <laughs> so what was so special about the Fast and the Furious trailer? Oh, well, I mean, the, the, the beautiful thing about the Fast and the Furious franchise is not I mean of course family yes they say fam every other word is family really uh, yes I mean if I thought you it watch... was about cars no well yes <laughs> it's complicated look these guys just live their life a quarter mile at a time <laughs> got it and you never know how long that quarter mile is or whether or not there's a nuclear submarine or a stealth bomber <laughs> what I don't I know thought why it was looking about at me cars. Like, is well, it not about well, cars? It's about cars. Was it about cars at the beginning and now it's not? Well, it's about family. <laughs> <laughs> it's about family. Okay. <laughs> not helpful. Oh. <laughs> if we put blades on this, it would be extra scary. It would be something out of a horror movie, yes. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like if there was like a villain that had one of these that had blades on it and was just like... <laughs> <laughs> Have you ever seen Master of the Flying Guillotine? No. <laughs> You should. Should I? <laughs> Doesn't sound like a good... It sounds exactly like what you just described. <laughs> I, at one point, I, I came up with a, a plot and characters for a juggling comic book. Mm. And I had... Um, oh, heroes for, like, each j prop. What was your juggling hero? I gotta know. Well, he, he could control... He was telekinetic. Um, okay, what was his name, though? I, he didn't have a name. I didn't Come make on. names yet. I just developed characters. <clears throat> so he was telekinetic, and and it was like this whole struggle of like, is it juggling anymore when you can control the balls in the air? And like, it was... <laughs> is, is telekinetic juggling just can't get respect in the industry? <laughs> no, it was more like, like, what, how, you know, when your thing that you love becomes like easy, mm. is how do you, do you still love it? And like, what does it become for you? Yeah. And... Uh, I had this whole thing that, like, you know, there, there was a lot of other ones. Oh, this looks good. Look, look, look. It's, oh, that's better. I lost it. That's better. It is getting better. It's getting better. And uh, the villain, I really was proud of my villain. He was, he, he was a kandama, an older guy, and he did Ooh. kandama. Mm. And his whole thing was that, his whole thing was about focus and how when you do kandama, um, he would be able to like telekinetically like uh, manipulate your body. So he would like sit there and do kanama in this like really rhythmic tap, 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 tap way. And then it would like snap your arm in half. <laughs> it was pretty <laughs> aggressive. His name was the Gondominator. The that's, that's what we're here for. That's the money. <laughs> I think I still really want to make it. The Gondominator. All right. And if anyone 
in the comments has any drawing ability at all. <laughs> Please help me. I want to make a comic book. This is in desperate need of coming to life. <laughs> it, it might be a little violent. <laughs> it has a lot of cool story. Aspects, Post it to though. your Instagram. <laughs> yeah. Anyway, back to uh, Fast and the Furious. Oh, yes. So, so submarines. And so, so anyway, uh, yes. So it's just about uh, a cop infiltrating a group of street racers um, and then becoming a part of the family. And that's sort of like a running theme. The bad guys always become good guys. Oh, that's nice. Well, that's a spoiler for the entire show. Well, it's more complicated than that. <laughs> I mean, we are talking ten movies. <laughs> And eventually, it does fall completely off the rails, and they just become superheroes, which is the best part about it, because they just decided, you know, who cares? <laughs> Let's just have fun and be awesome. Well, that's nice. And this, then the franchise became one of the most fun, awesome franchises that exists, <laughs> because Wait. they truly do not care. <laughs> oh, my arm. The, the most that I know about it is from Universal Studios. Yes. Uh, Fast and the Furious, what is it called? Oh, I've never actually seen what their thing is. You've never been to Universal? No, 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 I've been to Universal, I just haven't ridden the... The, the name of it, it's like a turbocharge or something. Yeah, I just it's, haven't been to the Fast and the Furious ride. Um, it's not really a ride, it's, a, it's part of the tour. It, is it what replaced, no, because Jaws is still a part of the tour. Oh. Yeah, it's just part of the tour where you go in and it's like... My allergies are acting up. Hold on. Oh, I went away again. I hate it when that happens. I hate it so much. Ah, oh, Dang it. Um, I, yeah, it's part of the tour and I think you like... It's part of like a 3D experience and like you're in the tram and the tram is part of it and they're going to save you and there's just like, there's like a plane and yeah. they're like lifting you up. It's ridiculous. Yeah. Well, eventually, Imagine that's what the movie's ev like. Eventually in the movies, every awesome actor you've ever heard of starts to make an appearance. Kurt Russell shows up as like a crazy dude. Is Stallone in it? Uh, Stallone's not in it yet, but... Bummer. You know, it's like they haven't... Re it's, they're more like into turning wrestlers into movie stars. They've been doing that a lot. Yeah, well, it works so for The Rock. John Cena is, well, the, the Rock, you know. Is he in it? John Cena's in the new one. Is The Rock in it? The Rock is not in the new one, but he's been in several really? of the Fast and the oh, Furious movies. Gosh. Yes, and, and, and Ronda Rousey was there for a minute. Uh, I mean, oh, man. I mean, the one where they go to Dubai is my favorite. I think that was part seven, but uh, they all sort of blur together. <laughs> I can't figure out in this thing if I'm supposed to like, I know it's like, I'm not supposed to hit the center and I'm supposed to kind of revolve around just outside the center, but it doesn't seem to work. I mean, it does. I can, I'm, I've already made progress, but. Yeah, you've made tons of progress. You see spinning. But I want it to like feel like comfortable. I've seen people just sit there and do it. You're making pizzas all day. <laughs> No. But anyway, we're going to have to chart our progress as we watch Fast and the Furious movies. Yeah. And then we can talk about them. <laughs> Should I watch the trailer for the new one? <laughs> would it be a good representation? It would, the trailer, I will promise you, you will have no idea. It's like jumping in on the 15th Marvel movie. <laughs> <laughs> who is this man with the Characters hair? will show up in these big moments in the trailer, and you're just going to be like, who is this? <laughs> Like, like, but everyone knows who that is. <laughs> I mean, we'll watch it at the end. Yeah, okay. Let's, let's watch it. Yeah, out of context. Because you haven't even seen the trailers for, like, any of the previous ones. All I know is that Paul Walker was in it, and then he died. Yeah. That was Fast and the Furious, right? That's, yes. <laughs> yeah, he was in them, and then he died he in was, real life. He was in them all the way until the seventh movie. Until he got in a car accident. Until he died in real life, yes. In a car accident. Yes. It's very sad. It's, That'd be like if I died in a juggling accident. How would you die in a juggling accident? I don't know, but it'd be really sad. If, if, threw, if you tried to juggle 15 knives? Yeah. Like three sharp. Chains, three chainsaws. Sharp, yeah, <laughs> knife. Uh, sharply. <laughs> and real chainsaws. Not those fake ones that people juggle. Spoiler alert. <laughs> Has anyone ever died juggling? I don't think so. 
she like, I, I know I have friends that have scars from chainsaws, <laughs> from doing chainsaw juggling. Well, I mean, um, people have set themselves on fire a lot. And, well, yeah. Why don't you juggle fire, Taylor? I don't know. Because it's fire. I like my skin. Because you're living in a state that's basically kindling. <laughs> yeah, you can't even buy half the stuff here. <laughs> It's weird how there's like stuff you can buy in certain states other than like guns, but like you can't buy bear spray here in California. It's really strange, except yeah. like in designated areas, I think. I, don't I tried know if to I've buy ever... it on Amazon. It was like, nah. I can't say I've ever needed bear spray though. You don't go camping. I go camping a lot. I needed it for camping. Oh, this is exhausting. Gotta work those up her arms. I just, I can't figure it out. I feel like I'm getting worse. Mm. <laughs> but that's what practice is. It is really fun. Like, I'm acting very frustrated because I am, but I'm having fun. Because <laughs> it's like, I love the process. I am incredibly angry. <laughs> Ooh. Ooh. Oh my gosh. Ooh, I can't keep it going, but you that. Felt it. You felt it though. It clicked. Mm. Mm, I feel like there's a moment from a movie that would represent that feeling. Mm. When something just magically works. Uh, oh, um, I'm thinking uh, Bruce Leroy in The Last Dragon when he catches the bullet in his teeth. I haven't seen that. I know, I just threw that out there because it's really obscure. <laughs> that would maybe work. I was thinking more like when the the kid from The Sword of the Stone pulls out the sword. That's very it's true. It's just like, oh, like, it was just so easy. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. That's what that moment felt like. It was easy for the first time ever. Oh, look at that. I totally get it. Okay. Okay. It's, it's happening. It's happening. I'm afraid it's going to go away. I don't want to keep going. No, 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 no. You got this. Somebody in one of the comments was like, I think you're faking being bad at these things. I'm like, sure. <laughs> It'd be really it's exhausting like you know how, to fake. You know how exhausting it is to fake being bad at something? It's like, it's also really hard to do well. How, how much less rewarding it is to fake being bad at something. And also just like ask any juggler that you know, if you know a juggler, to pretend to be bad at juggling and see how awkward it is. It's like asking somebody who's a, a good dancer to like be bad at it. You just can't. It's just really hard to like pretend to be bad at something. Yeah. I think because I tend to kind of like, I'm kind of a cartoony person. People think that I'm, you know, because I have that personality. Or it's, uh, man, it's but just it's, like, they get to see the progress, man. This is, this is the rough parts. This isn't like... This is like the learning process. Yeah, this isn't like I've been doing it for years and I'm... And just learning my, a new trick Here's or a performance where I'm going to do something incredible. <laughs> oh, come on. Come on. I lost it. <laughs> Can you tell? It's okay. We've all had those moments. Oh, maybe I need to go faster, but I feel like people go really slow when they do it. When I figure it out, I'll make a tutorial eventually, because <laughs> I want to help. Ow. <laughs> it actually doesn't hurt that bad, but it, it's like, you know, getting hit with anything in the face is not fun. It seems like raising your arm up that much would be a hell of a workout. It really is. It's like I mean, you could put a little, this you, muscle right you here. You could put a little weight on your wrist, and that would be like a crazy workout. Just lifting your arm up. <laughs> Just holding it up and doing this. Motion. Doing this like tss. <laughs> really good for my shoulders. You'd be ripped in no time. Just on one arm. <laughs> well, you know. <laughs> I don't know if I can do it on my other arm. Common male problem. How do I? It's that way. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> Oh no. Oof. <laughs> What's good is like, it makes me realize that I need to check myself sometimes because like I have not worked on this and the fact that I can do this is probably a big step for a lot of people. Yes. And I could do that immediately just because yeah. it's like juggling coordination with this hand, but I can't do it with this hand. So the important thing is to hit that middle piece and really just pop it up like in a, like you're spinning it really fast. 
And I just got to teach my hand how to do that. My brain understands it. But this is, I love this part of the learning process where it's just like, you're so bad. <laughs> and I should learn it with both hands so I can be like. It's like anything. It's just like playing a video game. <laughs> it looks so much worse. <laughs> like this side's like, la 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 la. Yeah. And this side's like, la 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 la. Harder and it's like it's hard. Yeah, <laughs> my left dominant. It's gotta be hard in your arm. <laughs> I don't have as much muscle in my left hand. <sighs> what time is it? Ooh, ooh. That's progress. Ooh. We're doing it for two minutes. <laughs> cool. I'll come back to that next time. <laughs> yeah. It's like wow. Okay. Later. <laughs> I really want to get the ability to just keep this on my hand for like five seconds. Okay. But like five long seconds. One, two, three, three four, four five. five. I don't know, man. It kind of did it immediately. <laughs> Should it be more? I mean... Ten you, seconds? I wouldn't say ten seconds. That seems like it's probably a stretch, but... Eight damn. seconds. <laughs> One, two, three, no. four. I lost it. it. Has to be a good spin. I will see. I just improved the spin. One, two, two three, three. Oop. I think five was good. <laughs> <laughs> you did it pretty perfectly the first time. <laughs> One, two, three, four. Oh, oh, oh that was close. <laughs> Eight seconds. Come on. Come on. <laughs> <What's this? laughs> nope. I lost oh, it. Oh, that was nice, though. Get that spin. Oh, it's hard when you... Because you do have to aim for that yeah. middle point, and I missed it. If you spin it too much. Some people can just start it. Like, my friend Lisa was just like, oh, yeah. And she just started doing it, and I was like, you're a wizard. <laughs> you're a wizard, Harry. <laughs> I don't know, Dan. <laughs> I don't know what's going to happen. <laughs> I don't know. Well, at least we already have it on tape. <laughs> Five seconds was really good. Five seconds. It started off real strong. <laughs> oh, man. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, <laughs> eight, back. nine, <laughs> ten. Did it. So many hits in the face. I'm gonna try one more time, and then I'm gonna call it a day because I can't learn it all in one day. You can't learn it all in one day. One, two, three. I'm just gonna. <laughs> that was fun. Nailed it. Nailed it. Ah, really good stuff. These are so fun though, like a really good workout. I need to practice the other side. <laughs> I'm gonna keep working on this throughout the week. I will check back in and of course I'm gonna continue practicing all the other skills that I've been practicing. So please keep watching and checking back in and listening to our fun conversations. Absolutely, become a Patreon Otter today. Do that, only $2 <laughs> and it helps so much. It's just, it's cheaper than anything you can buy anywhere. Yeah, it ought to be a good time. And if you're not subscribed, you can do that. But I assume you didn't make it 30 minutes into this video if you're not subscribed. <laughs> so thanks for being subscribed. I appreciate you. If you made it all the way into this video, we should have like a special code word. Let's That's do right. that. That's right. Uh, Pineapple. Pineapple. <laughs> this video, if you made it to this point. Yeah, put pineapple in chat. Comment <laughs> pineapple. For the faithful. And I will, you get a gold star. It's just, it'll be a fun little secret. And nobody else will know what we're talking about. Yeah. It's going to be fun. Our little safe word. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, not really. What? Yeah. <laughs> And don't forget, if you want to try out the flippers, like they're really fun. I know I was like frustrated, but they're actually really enjoyable, and uh, you can definitely do that. There's a link in the description for their website. It's just flipper.co, and you can use my code Taylor underscore tries.
So go give that a try and have a great week. Bye. John Cena. I have hair and you don't. Is that the woman from Black Mary? No, it's Charlize Theron. It's <laughs> even better. So many good actors in this. And John Cena also. <laughs> this movie looks awesome. That's not possible though. That is. That's not how physics works. What is this what is it about though? Like what do they do? <laughs> It's about family. It's about family. <laughs> hmm.